Item number, SCP-6888. Object class, safe. Special containment procedures. SCP-6888 is contained in a 15-meter ice locker at Site 7. No further containment procedures are necessary at this time. Description. SCP-6888 collectively designates a group of 25 human corpses exhibiting no signs of decomposition or decay at a cellular level. In addition to this effect, instances of SCP-6888 do not experience many other phenomena typically associated with death, including decreases in body temperature, skin discoloration, and production of putrescin. Each instance of SCP-6888 currently in containment is physically identical to a statesman, world leader, cultural figure, or other similar individual who had died in the decades prior to the object's discovery. As exhumation has revealed that the cadavers of these persons remain in their original places of burial, there is currently no tangible explanation for their similarities to SCP-6888. Discovery SCP-6888 was discovered on August 12, 1984, in Svalbard, Norway, beneath an abandoned structure believed to have served as a mausoleum for the objects at some point in the past. The building had fallen into disrepair before being acquired by containment operatives, and was entirely collapsed in certain sections, impeding SCP-6888's retrieval. The interior of the structure was divided into 26 burial chambers, each corresponding Footnote 1. With the exception of Chamber 26. See Discovery Log for further details. To an instance of SCP-6888, which were removed over the course of the next several hours and taken to Site-7 for examination. Below is an abridged list of notable instances recovered, along with descriptions of the chambers in which they were stored. Description of Instance Instance resembles former Japanese Emperor Maiji. Subject is dressed in traditional regal garb, and was clasping a rusted golden saber at the time of recovery. Description of Chamber The walls of the chamber are decorated with a series of brightly colored woodblock prints depicting various societal and military achievements attained under Meiji's reign. Notable examples include the proclamation of the 1889 Constitution of Japan, the first session of the Imperial Diet, workers constructing telegraph lines, and Japanese warships bombarding Russian forces during the siege of Port Arthur. Notes Instance was found situated in an ornate limestone sarcophagus, with the words lie and wait engraved at the base of the tomb in kanji characters. Description of Instance Instance resembles Serbian-American engineer Nikola Tesla. Description of Chamber Room is sparsely furnished. The floor is cluttered with notes on a variety of unfinished mechanical devices, with a particular fixation on the creation of automatons and the concept of artificial intelligence. Notes no burial rituals performed. Subject was discovered chained to a plain metal folding chair, with the words not yet engraved repeatedly onto the subject's seat and manchette. Description of Instance Instance resembles former Australian Prime Minister Harold Holt, dressed in a light blue swimsuit. Description of Chamber Chamber contains a large number of political paraphernalia for Holt's 1966 Liberal Party leadership campaign and the subsequent Australian federal election. The room also hosts a large number of spearfishing equipment, swimming supplies, and taxidermy of marine wildlife. Notes Instance currently under investigation for possible ties to SCP-3477. Description of Instance Instance resembles Turkish statesman Mustafa Kemal Ataturk, dressed in a black lounge suit. Description of Chamber Chamber appears to be an exact replica of Ataturk's personal quarters at Dolmambash Palace in Istanbul, Turkey. Notes Large portions of the chamber are charred or collapsed, believed to be due to a fire beginning with a large pile of incinerated kilim fabric in the northwest corner of the room. Description of Instance Not applicable Description of Chamber Chamber resembles the green room of the United States Executive Mansion. The chamber is filled to the brim with numerous materials from a variety of highly specific 19th century United States national elections, including 
1856 and 1848 United States presidential election, the 1852 Whig National Convention, and the 1856 Know Nothing Party nominating convention. Notes. A single open casket lies in the center of the chamber. DNA testing of skin cells left on the receptacle's padding have been identified as belonging to American soap opera star Alec Baldwin. The implications of this discovery are unclear at this time. Thank you all so much for watching, and a huge thank you to all of my patrons on Patreon. Special shout out to Everborn, Joe Light, The Bone Man, Tannis Ruler of All, and Doomsday LLC, Prince and Design. If you'd like to help support the channel, head on over to patreon.com slash drmaxwell. Link in the description.